In this video, we're gonna add a restart game button. So to do that, let's go ahead and duplicate one of our next question buttons. So I'm gonna right click and choose duplicate. Now we're gonna edit it so that instead of saying next question, it says restart game. So I'm gonna come into costumes and I'm gonna double click on the text and delete it. And instead type restart game. And I can rename the costume up here to restart game. That's fun. All right, so that's done. Now let's click on scripts to code this button. We want it to show up when we received a correct answer for number three, question number three. So I'm gonna change this yes two to yes three. And down at the bottom when it says this sprite is clicked, we're gonna broadcast. Instead of having it say continue to three, we're gonna create a new message called restart game. And we also need to change this drop down menu to say restart game. So once it receives the signal, the button's going to disappear. So that's good. Um, we need to do a few other things as well. So let's go ahead and go to our starting backdrop. So these are our backdrops up here. And we're going to add a script that says, when I receive restart game, I'm gonna switch my backdrop to the starting backdrop. All right, so let's just test this right now. Okay, so I got to question three and I, I clicked on the correct answer, so it gives me the option to restart the game. That's great. Let's see what happens when I click the button. Okay, so it does take me back to my start screen, but there are a few things that we need to do to clean this up. We need to hide our answer choices, our question, and our message here when we receive that restart game signal. And I also noticed that we need that start button to show back up. So this is really easy to do. Let's start with the start button. So when I receive, I'm going to events, when I receive restart game, I'm going to show. And again, let's just go ahead and tell it where to where to show. So forever in this XY location, which is the same place I can see up here at the top as the first time we had it show. So that's good. All right, let's go to our questions next. And let's add some code that says when I receive, and I'm just gonna add mine over here, restart game. I'm going to hide. All right, so that'll take care of question three hiding. Now let's go to our answer sprite and let's add some code that says, when I receive restart game, we're going to hide. And for each of the answer choices for question three, we need to add the same code. So events, when I receive, restart game I'm gonna hide let's just do this for each one okay now let's test our game to see what it does Restart game, oh, yes, perfect. It took us back to the beginning where we can go through the game again. Oops. Perfect, so our game is working perfectly. In the next video, we are going to add a score keeping ability to our game and then we will be done. Thanks for watching.